Good morning everyone. It's Sunday, October 1st, and that means it's time to put that stuff out finally. Uh, so this weekend's uh, weekend adventure, air quotes, I don't know if you can see that, weekend adventure is going to be a little bit different because we're not going to actually adventure out anywhere. We're going to have an adventure here and decorate the house for October slash Halloween. So it should be a lot of fun. Jacob, what time is it? Time to decorate the house for Halloween. <laughs> Dude Perfect's not going to be calling you. Hey, the, you know why they scream when they when they get so excited? Because they do it 18,000 times. 18,000 times. Well, I and need you to do it. And then when they finally get it, <laughs> they go nuts. Isn't that right? Gabriel. Me and Gabriel watch a lot of Dude Perfect. He screamed too much for me. So I go, I go, this is the no look hat flip. <laughs> <laughs> he was fascinated by that. Huh. What was daddy doing? You ready to go do Halloween? We're going to sit you in your pack and play in the yard so you can watch us. Does that sound like fun? You don't care? <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, we've got Gabriel's encampment set up. <laughs> He's not super happy about it. He's in the shade, a bunch of toys, some water, a fan in case he gets hot, his Gilligan hat. Daddy, the box me up dead. <laughs> We're ready to do this. Thank you, Daddy. Chair for Mommy not to help. <laughs> Time to decorate the house. Okay, everybody, quick status update. It's coming along pretty nicely. Thinking about leaving the Saints flag up this year because the way they're playing is downright terrifying. <laughs> so we might leave it up. I'll hang a skeleton from it, who knows. Gabriel? <laughs> so I, I finished that Gatorade one day and dropped that bottle on the floor and he's been playing with it ever since. We spent money on all these toys and all this stuff. But, but the free piece of the trash. yeah, the free piece of garbage is what he uh, <laughs> enjoys the most. I think we pay for the garbage too. So. Yeah, it's kind of like the dogs. Used to buy dog toys, but they got the most enjoyment out of like old socks. <laughs> Mommy having a snack. You broke a sweat yet? Nope. Uh huh. So here's a problem we run into every year: putting up lights in the daytime light is projected there can't see it can't see a thing gonna have to come back out tonight and we aim this thing but it's on it works here we go sarah's forcing me to take a lunch break why did i do that while i'm drinking we've been at it for two hours we're almost we're getting close to done I'd say we're three quarters of the way through well that probably says we yeah. Well, I'm we haven't three quarters. Next door neighbor yet. Either. Yeah, we still gotta go next door and, and do Susie's graveyard. So Gabriel's hanging in there and having a good old time. Now. Now it was a rough start, but he's doing good now. But he's rolling on the floor. So anyway, I'm gonna take my forced lunch break real quick so I can get back outside. Baby. <laughs> so we have the spooky door knocker thing, and uh, the little tab that usually holds it on broke off. After you know years and years of being used, it, it broke. So I asked Sarah if she would uh, try to fix it, <laughs> and this is what she came up with. Bless her heart. That's not gonna work. But I do genuinely appreciate her effort to uh, call it a solution. <laughs> uh, this is uh, one of my Pinterest projects from last year. It's kind of a ghost head thing anyway there's there's two of them they're 
females, I call them the sisters. I've got one hanging up in our house uh, on the outside. And I decided this year I was going to hang this one over at Susie's to add to her ever-growing Halloween decorations as well. Well, I'd say we're about 80% finished. I say 80. We've only got one thing left to put out the outside. And I say 80 because the last thing I'd put out covers the whole front lawn, turned into a graveyard. Oh, am I on the roof? You ask? Yes, I am. Why are you on the roof? You may be wondering. Well, the Halloween decorations at our house are an immersive experience. Y'all see when it's done. So I really don't want to like fall to my death. You're probably thinking, well, Jacob, if you don't want to fall to your death, you probably shouldn't film while you're walking on the roof. And you'd be right. So I'm going to stop filming while I walk on the roof. Okay, done. Done. Well, it's done. I uh, foolishly thought that I could get this done in an hour and a half. And it definitely took four and a half hours. Unfortunately, I don't have a big screen like they have on Fixer Upper that we can part just after a tension building break to show you what the house looks like. So I'm just gonna spin the camera around. All right, you ready? Here we go. And here it is. The Haunted Mansion. Or the Haunted Ranch. Not like cattle ranch, but house ranch. You know what I'm talking about. So we have our spooky sign, headstones all across the front yard. I repurposed some fencing when Susie and Ed replaced their fence. And then got some pallets, made them spooky, splattered some blood on them. You know, we got one of the sisters peeking up over there. I got skeletons invading my home. And then the skeletons on the roof. Not too bad. Time to go inside and do the inside and then we'll come out later when it's dark outside and show you get some nice uh, low light, low lit, poorly lit footage of the outside of the house. We came in and it was time to start decorating the inside of the house and Sarah started to not feel real well so she's back in the back. I think she's laying down. So in the meantime I've cleared off the mantle and Gabriel helped me unpack the indoor Halloween box. Didn't you? <laughs> yeah he did. So we got Halloween junk just kind of laying on or laying around all over the place. So it's time to get that where it needs to go. Guess what everybody? She's back. <laughs> she's making herself some ginger tea and she's gonna soldier on <laughs> like the woman I know. It's a good thing she's back because when I do decorations, I tend when I go rogue and do them on my own. The house tends to look like a, a college kid lives in it. A garage sale. <laughs> she's, at, she's at a garage sale, which is true. Because all of our Halloween decorations and Christmas decorations before we got married, the ones in my house came from the Walgreens that was um, in the parking lot next to the apartment I was living in. So, uh, since then, Sarah has classed up the joint and, um, you know, brought in some a little less... CVS decoration -y type things. Nothing more wrong with Z gallery. C Yeah, a little more Z Gallery. Nothing wrong with CVS Halloween. It gets the job done. There will be some CVS Halloween mixed in to our uh, Z Gallery Halloween. And a little bit of Pinterest, because I'm crafty. The good kind. <laughs> Alright, the little monster's hungry, so we're going to make some kale. He's going to get kale for the first time tonight. And then we're going to show y'all how the decorations turned out. So everybody sticks it out to the end, gets to see what it looks like.
All right, time for some kale. I don't know, Daddy. This is real chunky. Well, let's give it a try. See what <laughs> Ooh. Kale's a hard pass. <laughs> he said, Mommy, I swipe left on kale. Is that the right direction? I don't know. <laughs> We're happily married. We don't do Tinder. <laughs> I don't know. He's not like... What you think, Angel? <laughs> How pretty your eyes are, though. You okay? Okay. I'm telling you now, if he throws up green, I'm definitely using it. Some exorcist spit up would be perfect for our Halloween decoration video. I don't know, I think he makes really terrible faces every bite. You trying to chew it? See, it's chunky. Was it this chunky when you made it? I, I told you it was fibrous. <laughs> He's definitely trying to figure it out. Le. Yeah? What you think about kale? Definitely not attractive, that's for sure. He looks concerned, but he keeps opening his mouth for it. Oh man, the poops tomorrow are gonna be terrible. <laughs> oh no! Why you do that? <laughs> To be or not to be. <laughs> Alas, poor Yorick. Y'all made it. Here's the end of the video. Well, not the end of the video, but here's the inside decorations. My little Pinterest votive things are proudly displayed in front of the TV. And then here's where Sarah kept me straight. The mantle that I started while she wasn't feeling well. And then she finished it. This is interesting. Interestingly, another Pinterest project from last year. Some bottles. I made poison bottles. Where is the kale coming from? Sarah's cleaning up the baby. He's got There's kale so in every crevice. Kale. Okay, the sun has said enough. I can do this without the footage being horrible. Give you an idea what the front of the house looks like. Skeletons on the roof, gravestones in the yard, and even Susie got her yard done. So we have a two front yard long graveyard. Looks pretty good. Gabriel, I am your father. <laughs> Alright, so before we traumatize our child anymore, we're going to close this vlog. Thanks for sticking with us to the end. Hopefully it wasn't too bad. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel to see more, and be sure to hit the bell so it notifies you when there's a new video. Ding! New video from the Upshaws. <laughs> and leave in the comments and tell us how you decorate for Halloween. We always have a good time with it. and. Um, the neighborhood appreciates it. We had a lot of people drive by and tell us how good it looked and how excited they were. They uh, remembered it from last year. So um, give us a like, give us a comment, and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. We're almost to 100 subscribers. Woohoo! Woo <laughs> all right, we'll see you all later. Thanks for watching. Say bye bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Young Skywalker. <laughs>